Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing my current everyday makeup look. It's something super simple and cute. I've seriously been doing this for like the past week or so. I'm like just obsessing with this baby pink lipstick. Also, I'm going to be using all the new products from Lorac that I've just recently bought. In case you still have not added me on Snapchat, don't forget to add me and I'll leave my username down here. If you guys want to know how I got this look, then just keep on watching. So I already did my eyebrows, as you can tell off camera. I already moisturized and primed my face. Now I'm just going to go ahead and moisturize my lips so they can be ready. Um, and I'm using this Vaseline Lip Therapy. Just so they can be, you know, ready. Now I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeliner and I'm going to be using the NYC um, Liquid Liner. hardest part is always like matching them to see if you know they look the same. These eyelashes I am going to be using the Ardell 105. The glue I'm going to be using the Duo. Is that even how you say it? I love buying these eyelashes because they're so affordable um, it has one two three four so you know it's like what else do you need after applying my um, falsies I like going over lash glue with eyeliner just so it can look more neat and it can hide the lash band Then I'm going to go ahead and apply my um, MAC False Lashes Extreme Black and when I apply my mascara I just kind of like dabbing it upwards so my real eyelashes can stick to the falsies and then just kind of lightly going on top. Now for my foundation, I'm going to be using this Lorac Porefection Foundation in the color Light Beige and mixing it with this True Match from L'Oreal in the color Natural Beige as well. And I just recently bought this and honestly like I'm really liking it because it's super lightweight. It doesn't make my face look so cakey. It looks so natural. If you like lightweight foundations, then I really recommend this. In case you're wondering why I'm looking up here and then down here, it's because I have two mirrors. I don't know, I'm just, I'm just wanting to be all around the earth. And then for this one, since it doesn't have a pump, I just kind of go like this. Like, this L'Oreal True Matte, it's very liquidy. You know what I'm saying? I don't know but I just really like it before using a beauty blender in case you didn't know you have to wet it and obviously um, try it so you want to kind of use it like damp you know because some people use it without wetting it so they don't like how how the beauty blender works here today for the first time I tried the uh, Nair face cream and oh my god, now that I'm applying my foundation, it like stays on way faster. 
I really recommend it for those who have not tried it. And like I'm going to be using this <clears throat> Maybelline concealer in the color Fair Claire. I'm just going to go ahead and put it under my eyes. In the middle of my nose. Bringing it up to my forehead. My lip. And just a little bit in my chin. Using the Maybelline as well Master Concealer Medium Deep. So for this one, I just kind of like applying a little bit in my hand because it is darker, so I don't want any dark spots somewhere else that I don't need. my Lorac Pro um, contour. And I just recently got this too. I'm going with the deep contour. And I'm just gonna like dab it in, not like so harsh. And you just leave it like that. No, I'm just kidding. To contour my nose, I am going to be using this light contour just because I don't want something so dark there. And to go over the highlight in with the beige highlight, mixing it with the yellow highlight. I'm going to be going with my MAC Studio and I'm just going to go lightly to where the parts that I didn't do anything to so it can all even out. Going in with my Wet n Wild in the color um, 740 Bikini Contest and it looks like this. For my blush, I'm going to be going in with my Lorac in the color Spectra. And as far as my highlight, I don't really like highlighting a lot because I have oily skin and I already have like a really shiny face. So I just do like the cheekbones and a little bit of my nose. I'm going to be using the Shimmer highlight in my Lorac Pro palette.
prime my lips, I am going to be using the Anastasia Lip Primer. And honestly, if you don't have this, you have to go get it. It's amazing, especially if you like um, matte lipsticks. I'm going to be using the MAC Lip Pencil in the color SOAR. I think that's how you pronounce it. S-O-E-R. So it's easier to blend with my NYX soft matte lip cream in the color Tokyo and then on top of this I'm gonna be using my Anastasia in pure Hollywood um, applying this in the middle. I'm gonna use my Studio Fix Prep and Prime by Mac. Remix. Pretty boy, baby. Alexis, you feel. 